when I see the widows, the orphans, when I see so many tombs, so many sacrifices for the freedom and liberty of Vietnam, I reaffirm again that the whole people of South Vietnam will resist again any peace which demand the registration of South Vietnam and which will give the South Vietnam to the communist aggressors. People are calling you the obstacle to peace, Mr. President. When it's a just peace, a guaranteed peace, there's no one single obstacle in Vietnam. There will be, as long as it's a non-just peace, a, a, a surrender peace, a peace uh, which gives the South Vietnam to the communists, who ask the South Vietnamese to surrender the communists, there will be not only one till, but seven million and a half till who are against that. What is, what is the next step? What is the next step, Mr. President? What is the next step now? Ask the communists. We are, ready, we are ready to discuss with them. This morning, in my message, I said that today, I ask the North Vietnam to discuss seriously and to sign any peace and ceasefire agreement in Paris or anywhere.